It's no secret that one of the best ways to make money online is with affiliate marketing. Now, I've been doing affiliate marketing for a very long time now, and I've got some really good results from it over the last few years. And what I wanna do in this video is show you how to create an affiliate marketing website for free. That's right, you won't have to actually pay to create a website in this tutorial. And I'm gonna take you through step by step and show you everything you need to know to get your free website up and running so you can start making commissions with affiliate marketing. Now, if you don't know what affiliate marketing is, it's when you find a product online, like for example, if I created a software and I wanted people to promote it, I would give them a custom link. What they would do is go and send traffic to that custom link, and then when they make a sale, someone purchases that product that they're promoting, they will get paid a commission. And it's one of the best ways to make money online because you don't have to actually go and create your own product, and it's a very good beginner-friendly way to make money online. But you usually need a website to do that, and I know that a lot of people don't have the money to create a website, so that's why I'm gonna show you how to do it for free in this tutorial today. So make sure you watch it all the way to the end so you don't miss any of the steps. Now guys, before we move on, I'm doing a giveaway in this video. I'm giving away access to one of my courses and some cash. What you've got to do is hit that like button and then down below in the comment section, write, I like affiliate marketing because, and then finish the sentence. I want to know why you like affiliate marketing and why you think it's a great way to make money online. And then the winner will be announced in the next video. Now I bring out videos every single week showing you the best tutorials on how you can start an online business. So make sure you subscribe and tap that notification bell so my next video comes out. So let's jump into this tutorial and I'm going to show you exactly how you can make your own profitable affiliate marketing website for completely free. Let's get started. All right, guys. So the first step to actually going and creating your own affiliate marketing website for free is you need to choose a platform to go and actually create this website on. Now, there's two types of websites you can create. You can create a paid website or a free website. Now, obviously this speaks for itself. A paid website you pay money for, usually a monthly fee, and a free website is free. Now, there's some disadvantages to having a free website, and we'll talk about those as we go through this tutorial. Now, first I actually wanna show you some paid platforms, just in case you wanna start a paid website, because really in the long run, you probably should pay for a website because you own it and you do get more benefits. So I'll show you, um, two ways that you could do that. So for example, you could use a platform called Bluehost and they'll charge you $2.75 per month to host your website, okay? And you get a free domain name and things like that. So that's another advantage of actually paying is you get your own domain name. So you could use something like Bluehost or you could use something um, like SiteGround here where they have plans and they actually host the website for you and you get more control and you get your own name and there's just lots of benefits. However, this tutorial is how to create a free affiliate marketing website. You can use um, websites like like Wix.com, they actually have a free plan where you can create a website for completely free. Now the disadvantage of this is you don't really have a lot of control over the name, but you can still create a website, okay? But I like another platform. So Wix is awesome, you can go and use Wix if you like. But what I actually like to use is Google Sites. You can actually go and create a free, completely free website, full website, with Google Sites. All you need to do is go and create a Google account. So go into Google and put in Google Sites and then click Google Sites down here, okay? And then click the sign in and then go and create it. Now I already have a Google account. So when I click on this, it takes me to my Google Sites and I can go and create a Google site. This is the one that I use for my tutorials. And it's really simple to do. That's why I actually like to use Google Sites because it's so easy for beginners. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna actually show you how to create an affiliate marketing website step by step on Google Sites. But first we need to actually look at affiliate marketing programs and find products that you can promote. Now this is more about how to actually build the website and stuff. So I will leave some more free tutorials below on how to make money with affiliate marketing. So if you guys haven't heard um, of, or well, you've probably heard of Amazon, but you might not know that you can actually promote Amazon products for a commission via a um, network called Amazon Associates. 
So Amazon Associates lets you take any product from Amazon and you can promote any of these products on Amazon for a commission. This is pretty much the biggest affiliate marketing network online. Now this is great if you're a beginner to affiliate marketing and you're just looking for some products to promote. Now do keep in mind that the commissions are a little bit lower with Amazon but they are better at selling products than most affiliate marketing networks. Now another affiliate marketing network that I use quite often is called clickbank.com but keep in mind this is a lot different to Amazon. What you're doing is you're actually promoting products in the fitness and health niche, the e-business and e-marketing, so like online courses and stuff like that. So if we go to health and fitness, um, you can promote these types of products, right? So let me just log in and I'll show you real quick in case you're a newbie to this. So what I can do is I can log into ClickBank here and I can go into the marketplace and I can click on some of these categories, right? And I can just simply click promote and I would get an affiliate link here where I would, so I just go generate hop link and I get an affiliate link, okay? And this, this tells you how much commission you get. So $29, $19, $216. It really depends on the product, on what type of commission that you get. And there's all of these different niches that you can find products to promote in. Um, this one here is actually a good one. I've made some pretty good money in the past with this. But just remember that ClickBank is completely different to Amazon. It's more for promoting courses and software and stuff like that. I will leave a video below on how you can make money with ClickBank if you want a full tutorial on that. But I just wanted to show you this network because it is one of the top affiliate networks online where you can find products to promote. But for this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to set up an Amazon website where you can promote Amazon products. So let's jump into that because I don't wanna make this a huge, big, long tutorial because it doesn't have to be. This is a really simple way to create an affiliate marketing website online for free without spending any money. So the first step you wanna do is go back to Google Sites and you wanna click. Um, you can click from blank if you want or you can try some of these themes, but the um, there's all of these different types of themes here like small business, Christmas party, portfolio, saloon, uh, club, class. There, It's a little bit limited, um, but one of the ones that I like is called Project, okay? So all you've got to do is click on Project. Now, with this Google website, it's like a normal website, okay? So let me explain to you the structure. First of all, we're on the home page. So this is the home page. This is what it's going to look like when people go to your website, your main page, okay? Um, and then on the, if you click pages up here, we've got home page, we've got history, team, and FAQ. So these are pages on your website, okay? And this is the home page. So what I want to actually do is do things a little bit backwards here, and I want to show you how to set up an affiliate page with an Amazon product on it, okay? And then we'll come back and we'll do some stuff with the home page just to, because we need to actually have the other page to customize our homepage, okay? But it's very easy. All you do is you click on stuff and you can change things, write text and stuff like that. So we'll come back to how to set up logos and all that stuff in a minute. What you wanna do is you wanna click on pages, okay? And you wanna to go to the plus symbol down here and we wanna add a new page. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to name this page so it really depends on what type of product you're going to be promoting. So what I'm going to be doing in this tutorial is doing camping tents. Okay, and I've actually gone out and got some information ready for this. So um, I'm going to do best seven best camping tents big enough for the family for under $100. So what I would do is I'll put best camping tents and click done. Now before we actually get to this page, so all you do is click on the page and then this is the page right here. Now, what I want to show you actually is if we go to Google and we put in Ecom Elite's review, which is one of my products, you'll see that someone has actually done a review on my course and it shows up in Google using sites.google. So it does work. You can use these free websites and they do show up in Google. But I would recommend using a paid website for long term, for your long term affiliate marketing business because it is going to be better for you in the long run. But if you want to create a nice, 
free site quickly than Google Sites does index in Google and it will show up for your keywords depending on how hard those keywords are. So I'm gonna go back to the project here, but I just want to show you that it actually does show up. See, sites.google.com. But what we wanna do here is first of all, you wanna to go to um, pixabay.com and put in tents or camping, okay? And what I wanna do, this is a website where you can find free images, okay? Um, that you can use without giving any credit. It's royalty free images. I'm gonna click this one here and I'm gonna to go to free download and I'm gonna download it. And the reason why we wanna download this is because we want to um, use it as our banner. So that's the, I'll just let it download. So I'm gonna upload it to here by going change image and upload. And I'm going to upload that image that I just downloaded. Okay, and now we have a nice little tent here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna change this now to my um, heading here. So I've, I've just put it all in here to make things easier. So seven, seven best camping tents, and I'm gonna actually spread this out like that. So everything's really customizable. I'm gonna make this a lot smaller, probably like a 30, maybe like a 48. Yeah, it's good. 48. Okay, so that, look, that looks really nice. Seven best camping tents big enough for the family. Under, um, under. I wonder if I can actually change, yeah, for under $100. Now keep in mind, this is a separate page from the home page. This is not the home page. If I click on home, this is the home page. This is a separate page, okay? Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to insert up here and I can actually insert some things in here and what I what you can do is you can insert different things so you can insert a table of content you can insert a YouTube video you can insert anything you want um, you can insert a text box here so just click that and it brings up um, a text box okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go here so I'm only gonna put in one tent okay just for this tutorial because it's a tutorial and I don't want to show, I don't want to take up too much of your time. But I'm going to paste this in here, tent number one. And I'm going to, like you would have probably have some text here like, hey, these are the best, seven best tents. Come and check them out. I'm going to go tent one and I'm going to do probably some nicer text maybe. Bring this up to about 20, probably like a tw an 18 maybe, a 20. Yeah, 20 will do. So number one is a three to four person tent. I'll actually put, um, yeah, so three to four person instant camping tent pop up, he wolf family tent. You probably wanna make that a little bit better. But what I can actually do is I can bring in some more text, okay? And I can copy this here. And I can put some more text in here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change the text again because I don't like that one. I'm gonna change it to Arial. And you'll probably wanna put some more text in, but if we go to preview up here, you kind of get an idea now of what it's starting to look like, okay? You can do different designs. You could probably bring this text up a little bit. But if we go back, what I wanna do now is I actually wanna bring this in, okay? So this is like, um, this is a block with an image and I've got an image of a tent that I downloaded from uh, Amazon. So you can just go to here and you can click on here and you can simply right click and save the image. Um, and what I'm gonna do is add that image, upload, and there's the tent. And what I wanna actually do is put in here features. And I wanna make that um, a little bit smaller and then into the text box here, I'm gonna actually put some of the features of the product. This is what you, uh, what I would recommend you do is go and find other Amazon sites, affiliate marketing sites, and kind of see what they're doing. But I'm gonna take out um, this here just to make a little bit smaller, right? There's a lot of like stuff I need to fix here, okay? So um, number one is this tent here, and then we go down, and then what I can actually do is I can um, add some more stuff, so like a button, okay? And what I'm gonna do here is put check pricing. 
and we need to actually get a link. So I'm gonna, what you wanna do is sign up to Amazon Associates and get your affiliate link. And I'll show you exactly how to do that right now. So I'm just gonna sign in and come back. All right guys, so I'm signed into Amazon Associates. Now, this works for any affiliate link, right? So whether it's ClickBank or whatever, you wanna just go and get your affiliate link, you'll get a custom link. What you wanna do is get the um, ASIN number. So go back to the product that you wanna promote and scroll down um, all the way down until you get the ASIN number, okay? A SIN number, that's just what I call it. And then go back to your Amazon Associates and paste it in here and then go go and it should create a custom link for you. And then you go to get link. Now there's a few rules you have to follow with Amazon's links. You have to use their raw links. So you have to use the links in these boxes. You can't shorten them, you can't change them. So what you wanna do is click the short link here. This is the best one. And you copy this link, okay? Then go back to here and put it in here. And then go to insert. And now there's a button here. Uh, you should be able to move it as well. And here we go. So check pricing. When people click this, they'll be taken to that product. And if someone purchases through your affiliate link, you'll get a commission. Now, obviously you wanna make it a little bit better than this. So here's an example, right? Best campaign tents of 2020. And you see down here, they've got quite a bit of text and they've got some stuff here that you won't have. Um, this is why it's good to actually have a paid site because you get more functionality and you can do better sites. But this is like an example. So you would just add more stuff like, um, you know, add another tent in here. You could add multiple tents, like do a, uh, like a little section here where you can add multiple tents. So you would just go through and you would edit the page to your liking. But for this example, we've done seven best camping tents big enough for the family and we've put in one tent. And if we send people to this page or we go and rank for specific keywords, once again, I have videos on how to get traffic below, then you could potentially make some money. Um, and there's all of these different things that you can bring in to this page, okay? And then all you do is preview if you wanna preview it and this is the page here. Okay, so now let's go back to the home page real quick and I'll show you why I wanted to create it now. Okay, click home. And the reason I wanted to actually create the home page now is because we can actually link to that, um, to that article that we wrote. So I could do something like best seven best tents. Okay, and then I can change the image to um, replace image and upload and I can change it to that tent. And you could probably have a better picture, but I could put in um, these are the seven best tents for your family, right? So what I can do is I can actually go and take my articles and I can create this home page um, for people to come. When they come to the home page, they can actually click on this. And you can change all of this as well. If I go and get another tent image or camping, for example, let's just say, uh, camping, right? Some people camping, I can download that. I can go back here and I can change the image again. Downloads. And you can change it to the name of your store or uh, your website or whatever, right? So um, we'll just call this camping down under. We review the best and latest camping gear, okay? And you can edit all of this and do whatever you like. You can even do a different header type if you want. So you can do a large banner or just a banner. So it makes it a little bit smaller, that actually looks better. And then you can actually put some text in here like, hey, this is our um, website on the best camping gear and stuff like that. And then what you wanna do is go and add your pages. So you might do some pages on the best camping torches and then you would add them here. Um, and you can simply insert stuff exactly like I showed you before. So I can insert this and I can move this wherever I want and I can simply add an image and I can do whatever I like. So you can change the home page and do it exactly like we did the other page. 
it doesn't really matter. But what if you wanna change your logo? You can actually go into Google and go free logo maker. And there's all of these free logo makers that you can use where you can create a very basic logo for your um, website. So a very basic logo, but you can create a logo. Once you've created that logo, you simply upload it by going to edit logo, okay? And you can change the image here. And then you've got project name as well. So you can name this your website, right? So I would just name this camping down under. Um, that's some Australian stuff right there, down under. And so now you've got this like nice little site. Now, what I wanted to um, explain to you, right, is the publish is quite important. So when you go to publish, right, this is gonna be your website URL, sites.google.com view camping down under, okay? This will be your keyword or your website name. There's a few things you can do here. You can go custom URL. So you can actually add your own custom URL. So you can go to somewhere like um, namesilo.com and you can pick up a, a .com for $8, right? So you can pick up, you can literally go and pick up a um, website name for $8 or a .shop for eight for $2.19, um, okay? Now I do know that this is a on how to create a free website, but you should at least buy a domain name for your website because it's just better for Google. Um, it's really up to you, but you should buy a domain name because then you have better control. Because then, like for example, if I put in camping down under, so if I put in camping down under, right, um, I can actually buy camping down under for $8.99 per year. And then I can actually add that and that will be my website name instead of having um, this. This is the downfall of having a free website, okay? But it will still show up in Google. Um, and who can view your site? Make sure it says everyone. And then where it says request public search engines not to display my site, make sure that is unticked. You don't want that ticked. And then simply click publish, okay? It's very important. And then it, your site is actually live. Now, and you can go here and you can go change some settings and stuff like that. Now, one thing you wanna do is you wanna go up to here and you wanna go to publish settings and you wanna actually get this name, okay? So get the website URL. I think actually I've already got it. So I've actually got it here and I put it in, okay? And you wanna actually click on the page that you created and you wanna see what the name is. So it says best camping tents. The name is important because this is what Google reads and it will show up that in Google, like that website I showed you before, Ecom Elites, because they have Ecom Elites in the name of the URL, it shows up for Ecom Elites, okay? So if you wanna change this, it's really important, depending on what type of keyword you're trying to rank for, um, you wanna change it in here, okay? What Google does is they pick up your keywords in here uh, and in here as well. Um, but more importantly, you want to make sure the URL is the, the name you want. So let's just say that our keyword, right, is best camping tents um, for families. That's our keyword. That's what, that's what we want our website to show up when Google, for when people search that keyword. So I would go back to my pages and here, and I would go to the little, there's some little buttons here, and I would go to um, properties and name. And I'm gonna change it to best camping tents for families, okay? That's what I want my page to rank for. So I'm gonna go done, and then I'm gonna go publish. Now if I go back to home, and I go back to best camping tents, you'll see that now the name has changed, okay? So now it says best, so now it says best camping tents for families, and I have best camping tents, and then I would probably change the title to best camping tents for families, and then I'll put some text in here. But this video is about actually creating a website for free, and I've just showed you how you can create your own affiliate marketing website for free that looks beautiful and that you can actually send people to to promote your affiliate marketing products. Okay, and here's your other pages here. If you wanna add more pages, it's very simple. You just go back and you just go um, to insert on, let me go back again, you go to pages, sorry, and then you go to um, add new page. You can add as many pages as you like. You can actually build up your 
own affiliate marketing website. Now, if you want some more tutorials on how to get traffic to your affiliate marketing website, how to do some more affiliate marketing strategies, I will leave some videos up on the screen right now that will take you through step by step how to get traffic and how to start your own affiliate marketing business. Don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, tap that notification bell. Any questions, let me know below and I'll see you on one of the videos on the screen.